Alright guys, what's going on? It's Christian here from AFC Colossal back with another Next Level League video. Now, we are into the third week of this league and we have a very, very tough game in Mongolian Horses coming up who are second only to Hashtag United in this league. What will this third game bring up today? Mongolian Horses on a run of form and AFC Colossal out of form. But let's go to the game to see if... AFC Colossal can cause an upset and get the win. Welcome ladies and gentlemen to the third game. It's AFC Colossal kicking from left to right versus Mongolian Horses. The last game in these orange bibs before the kit comes in and AFC Colossal get us underway kicking from left to right in this tough game against Mongolian Horses. Mongolian Horses with a throw in. Straight forward. He's turned the defender there. Decent strike across goal, unlucky with that strike. AFC Colossal coming forward, Beaky with a ball over, finds Pete and Dave now picks up the ball from Pete. The ball falls to Jim Daly who's trying to look on his outside but can't get the ball out of his feet. Oh that's a great bit of skill there from the Mongolian Horses player who's come out, done the keeper. That is a great goal, what a touch that is over the top. Left foot, dummy the keeper out opened up a very little bit of space and has scored the first goal as Mongolian Horses 1 AFC Colossal nil. Sam with a quick corner into Jim who strikes into the body of a Mongolian Horses player and it almost finds its way in. Mongolian Horses now with a throw on the outside. Keeper, keeper, keeper. Good goal for Mongolian Horses there. Keeper should have saved there. A cross on his left foot into the corner. Keeper gets a hand on it. Should save it. 2 0 Mongolian Horses, and they're very happy about that one. Mongolian Horses now. Keeper plays out to number 14, who's free on the left. They're playing it around nicely. Number 9 now. AFC Cross are doing everything they can to get back, but still number 9 on the ball. And that's 3 0. Yeah, this hasn't been a great start from AFC Colossal. Can they do anything to bring this game back? Mongolian horses cruising, cruising here. AFC Colossal playing it out from the back. Jim on the ball. Plays left foot, ball across. Great touch there. Unlucky not to get more on it there from Lee, but he's going to chase it down. Oh, that's so close there from Lee. Good work rate on his debut for AFC Colossal down the left hand side unlucky not to score there Mongolian horses playing it nicely around the back comfortable in this game would be the word and that is half time 3-0 Mongolian horses very comfortable in that first half AFC Colossal have it all to do in the second half Mongolian horses have been by far the better team AFC Colossal will need to play much better in this second half to get the game anywhere near the score that they want it to be and Mongolian Horses kicking it around nicely to start off the second half. Ball through to number six here. Lee cuts it out well. Well worked. Great bit of skill there down the left hand side. Good save from the keeper at the near post. Mongolian Horses still got the ball. Still got the ball. And well saved by the keeper who distributes it quickly. Jim plays the ball across. Great drop off there from Beaky, who finds Sam on the outside. Now Sam's going forward with the ball, plays the ball back to Beaky, who comes into Sam. Decent strike, unlucky, and Lee lashes wide on the left-hand side. Now Lee coming out from the back to Dave, who's got a little in front of him. Unlucky trying to find Sam there, and the ball comes back down the middle from Mongolian Horses. Mongolian Horses with a chip over the top, and that is 4-0. Great ball from Mongolian Horses over the top here. Lee unlucky with the slide, ball into the side, netting, Mongolian horses, finding it far too easy to find spaces here and it's 4-0 and AFC Colossal need to up their game going forward and at the back. Now Mongolian horses running, great pace from number 92 there, it's gone past and that's easy for 5-0, far too easy there, Mongolian horses, number 92 on the outside, gets a run. Plays the ball across the middle and that is a backhill goal. Similar to a goal scored by Copper 90 last week. But good finish from Mongolian Horses. They're doing a professional job on AFC Colossal who are all but out of this game. Now a long ball. Great long ball. Finds one of the players. Decent save there. Coming back. Great save again. 
and that just about sums up AFC Colossal's day here. Now the ball over the top finds its way over Beaky. What a takedown that is. Decent save from the keeper who comes out to claim. Great second save from the keeper who finds his way back into it. And the third save right on the fingers. Literally the only place that that ball could go in. Mongolian horse is relentless now in their assault on AFC Colossal. Coming down the side looking to get a shot away on the left foot. Decent save from the keeper who puts out for a throw. Lee looking down the left plays the ball through the legs now it's Sam who goes out but it's cut out again by Mongolian horses and Lee's now looking to get back ball across the outside again same as before it's saved but the keeper didn't know much about that now AFC Colossal looking to break but the ball overplayed there one way traffic now from Mongolian horses who are looking to increase their lead good turn there from number seven who's going to get shot away right into the side netting Far too easy from Mongolian horses now. It's amateur hour from AFC Colossal. Left footed strike, right into, in off the post actually. Good strike from the number seven there. Mongolian horses now. Looking to add. Stevens breaks through. Great ball on the outside. It's far too easy. Players left wide open. Great reverse ball there from Stevens. Goal too easy. And this has been a colossal upset or a shambles, <laughs> one of the two. <laughs> FC Colossal now trying to do everything they can to get something in this game. A goal would be great, but that is it. Full time on the game. Absolutely destroy FC Colossal there who have been hammered by Mongolian horses in this game. There's no other way to describe it wasn't a great game at all from the guys who know and will find out what they think now in the post-match comments. <coughs> Lee, congratulations, you have been voted the Bet Bright Man of the Match. Um, it, I'm not gonna lie, it was a tough vote because um, <laughs> I don't really know how, <laughs> how, how he did it. I feel like I was like when, you know when they say like the best pit of the sandwich is the bread? Right. That was probably that tonight, because okay. they were so poor. I, well, I'm not even bred. I'm just slightly less smelly. <laughs> We've got good players in this team. It's not a bunch of useless players at all. It's just, we need to get used to playing seven aside, because I know it's only two players, but the difference between five aside and seven aside, it, it's huge. I mean, when the ball goes over head height five aside, it's, it's a free kick immediately. So when you're trying to deal with balls over the top here, it's completely alien to you. So it's, it's, it's just a whole new game, pretty much. It's so different. Keep it positive. What positive can you take away from that game? <coughs> it's finished. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think going into it, we knew it was going to be a hard game. I had a good result last week. But um, yeah, we've seen the other team's results. Hopefully we can try and get an early goal, get a bit of confidence in the team going. So I think that's what we missed today. Like Beaky said, we started well, but as soon as they got a couple of goals, they started taking a lick and then it's going over. Uh, I thought they started relatively slowly. We did well to keep them out um, at the start, but they just then took full control of the game. They're a different uh, level of fitness to us, a lot of ability. Every player's got ability out there, and um, I think they got a great chance of winning it, to be honest. As a defender, how did the weather affect your game tonight? Yeah, it was difficult conditions, uh, but like I say, it was the same for everybody, so I can't use that as an excuse. No excuses. No, no excuses. And how did you find playing their strikers who were very, very tricky yeah, and skillful? Good team. They big lad up there and a couple of small boys playing off and they just played it to perfection. So, fair play to them. Come all the way from Ireland for that result. How does that feel? Oh, I'm not coming again. <laughs> First and last. In all seriousness, um, you've been keeping up with what's going on in the WhatsApp group. Um, morale's high. Say something positive about AFC Colossal. Uh, they're a good bunch of lads. There you go, there bunch you of go. lads, Support great. In the comments, by the way, try and be, you know, Support. critical. <laughs> Supportive, but you can be critical. Just keep it constructive, keep it constructive. So the game didn't go great. It didn't go great. Um, <laughs> that, right, if you know Mongolian horses, make sure you go check out their channel in the, in the description below. You'll know that they've been playing a lot of football. However, uh, there was a lot of issues. We haven't dealt with the fact that we transitioned from five to seven aside. Balls over the top, we need to be dealing with. Balls through the center, the ball kept skipping off. The conditions were horrible, but they were horrible for both of us. 
So I can't use the conditions as an excuse. Can anyone think of an excuse? <laughs> anyway, so next week, next week, hopefully we can pick up next week. We haven't won a game yet. Keep your heads up. We can do this next week. We can do it. Lee's not here, so we've got a better chance. <laughs> and um, as always, keep it colossal.